Hey everyone, welcome back. Today, we're talking about a moment we've all had bumping into an old friend. It's surprising, emotional, and brings back memories. You'll hear from Ethan, a busy project manager, and Mason, a freelance writer who captures life's surprises. They'll share their story of reconnecting after years apart. Before we dive in, have you ever run into an old friend unexpectedly? How did it go? Share in the comments and let's get started. Hey Mason, I wasn't expecting to run into you here. How's it going? Oh wow, Ethan. I didn't expect this either. I'm doing pretty well, just keeping busy with work and life in general. What about you? It's been so long since we last caught up. How have you been? Yeah, it really has been a while. I've been good, just the usual grind. It's funny, I almost didn't recognize you for a second. You've really changed. Since the last time I saw you, new haircut, new style, everything. I guess a lot has changed, huh? Time does that to us. I've tried to keep up with the times, I suppose. But you're looking pretty different too. I remember you being more laid back, but you seem really polished now. What's been going on with you? Did you finally decide to focus more on your career? Yeah, I've been working on my career, trying to climb the corporate ladder. But you know how it is, things can get pretty hectic. I miss the old days when life was simpler. Remember, when we used to just hang out after school, not a care in the world? Oh, those were the days. We'd grab some snacks, maybe play a game, and just chill. I miss that too. Life seemed so much easier back then. But hey, do you remember that time we skipped class to go to the beach? That was such a crazy day. We got in so much trouble afterward, but it was totally worth it. Do you ever think about those times and wish we could just go back, even for a day? Absolutely, that was one of the best days ever. We were so carefree, just living in the moment. I've actually thought about that day more than a few times over the years, especially when I'm stuck in a long meeting or buried in work. Those memories really do stick with you, don't they? They really do. Sometimes I wonder if we lost something along the way, you know? Like, we're so caught up in being adults that we forget to have fun. But then again, I've had some pretty good times recently too. I started picking up new hobbies, like photography. It's been a great way to unwind. Have you found anything that helps you relax? Honestly, I've been so focused on work that I haven't had much time for hobbies. But I've been meaning to get back into painting. I used to love it, and I think it might help me de-stress a bit. Maybe I should finally dust off those old paintbrushes. You totally should. It's amazing how something creative can really take your mind off things. I'd love to see what you come up with. Maybe we could even do something together, like a little art day. It'd be just like old times, but with a twist. That sounds like a great idea, Mason. We should definitely plan something soon. Speaking of which, do you think we should try to hang out more regularly? It'd be nice to reconnect and not let so much time pass by again. Absolutely. I've missed our talks, and I think it'd be awesome to catch up more often. Life gets busy, but it's important to make time for friends. How about we grab coffee next week and see where it goes from there? We can catch up properly and maybe even make some new memories to look back on. I'm in. Let's do it. And who knows, maybe we can even make this a regular thing, no more losing touch. I think we owe it to ourselves to keep the friendship alive. 
Definitely. I got a good feeling about this. It's funny how bumping into an old friend can make you realize what you've been missing. I'm really glad we ran into each other today, Ethan. Here's to reconnecting and making the most of it. Same here, Mason. I'm really looking forward to it. And hey, let's not just talk about it, let's make it happen. I'll shoot you a text later to confirm the coffee date. Sounds perfect. I'm looking forward to it already. It feels good to know that some things don't change, like how easy it is to fall back into conversation with you. See you next week. Can't wait. Take care, Mason, and we'll pick up where we left off soon. You too, Ethan. See you soon. Thanks for the chat, Mason. This was great. I'm really glad we got to catch up. And to everyone watching, I hope you enjoyed listening in on our conversation. Remember, friendships like these are worth holding on to, even if life gets busy. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more conversations like this one. And please, share your own stories about reconnecting with old friends in the comments below. We'd love to hear them.